Yeah, what's up, Tim? What's up? How's it going? All yeah. right. We got a few minutes here. What do you got? Uh, yeah, hey, I got a problem I'm having here. I'm uh, I'm trying to get my girlfriend to have a threesome with me. I kind of think her friend's into it. Yeah. But in a way, I kind of think that her friend just wants to get a little bit of me behind her back. Wow. Now, well, well, we have an expert uh, on the show today. This oh, guy okay. has wants to get his girlfriend into a threesome situation with his uh, girlfriend's friend, best friend. Yeah, that, well, one of her best friends, yeah. But he thinks the friend just wants a piece of him. Yeah, but it's not. that's not the point. It's what he wants. Right. How old are you, Tim? I'm 22. 22. Do you, uh, do you think you can handle the pressure of it, the intimacy that you're going to want to have with this other chick? Well, see, the thing I'm thinking about, I'm worried about, you know, once I get this, I'm going to be all over this other girl. Yeah, you, you, like you, you shouldn't do it, but you're too young to think like that. Yeah, if you're thinking that now, it's over, John. Yeah, you're too young to do. You might as well just say, you might as well do it and then ruin your relationship because you're a young dude. dude. Yeah, let's be honest. You're well, 20. I ruin my relationship. See, I got, I got a one year old son with this. So girl. don't do it then. Oh, oh do it. all right. You got your. And another thing, don't kiss her. If y'all do do the threesome, do not kiss her. That's where it gets. Uh, do intimate. not show. That's where that's that's uh, treat, going too far. Treat her bad when you're having sex with him. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> to you. Treat well, her what like do you garbage. Think about just doing it behind her back. You. That's a mistake. It's like, listen. If you got a girl, and this is what I'm saying, being a young dude. If you got a girl that's willing to to let you get some side, as long as the rule is she's there, you, you're being greedy. You you just that's a that's a nasty ego. Oh, there's always little jokes going on between us, you know, like talking about, you know, oh, I, I told her one day, you know, hey, I wouldn't mind if you cheated on me as long as it was with that girl, Jackie, you know, and she tells Jackie, because we're on the phone, Jackie's laughing in the background, and I'm like, well, as long as I could be there, too, and then they're all like, oh, yeah, well, you could join in and this and that. They're always joking around. Is, is Jackie a slut? What's up? Is she a slut? Who, Jackie? Yeah, like you think she'll go for this? I kind of think she is, but see, that's why, like, I know her cousin and everything, too, and her cousin tries to tell me, like, oh, she's going to she's gonna try to do you and this and that, and she's probably going to try to do you behind Morrissey's back and this and that, and well, I let, do my relationship. You know what? Let me, let me give you, this is the one advice you got to have to rise above that. You have to be better than both those girls. You have to be thinking to yourself, they're both idiots, and whatever their plan is, you got to rise above it. So one of them girls might have a plan that they might be jealous. Anything they want to do with you, it really has nothing to do with you. It has something to do with them. So this other girl may be jealous of your girlfriend and might want to pull that little, that, that coveting kind of, uh, what, what is it, covet your neighbor kind of thing. So she yeah. might be just wanting you mm. just for her own personal ego. Rise above both of them. Just get your your thing off. Whatever the good radio <laughs> word is, just just do be righteous. Get two girls. Don't you do you understand that even getting to the the the, the cusp of sleeping with two women makes every guy like the idea of it makes people horny. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> you're almost there. <laughs> yes. Some guys don't even can't even entertain what you're having a problem figuring out what you're gonna do after. Just get some righteous duo. What, what's the word I can well, use on a radio? This guy is at the point duo. right now where all he needs is to get all all three of you in a room with a little bit of booze Lots and, of and and the situation's done. It'll and, take care of itself and 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 take Patrice's advice. Don't kiss the other one. Yeah, don't kiss her. Don't. But you can do anything else. You can do any everything. other nasty thing you want. <laughs> Just, but as soon as you uh, give her a kiss, it's over. Don't look at her with <laughs> longing <laughs> eyes. Other room or something? Huh? What about if my girlfriend wasn't around? Would it be alright to kiss her then? Look, he, well, you he's know what? greedy. He oh, just wants yeah. intimacy. Dude, it's, you, it's you just want right. this other chick. Yeah, you just you might as well just I'm move really, on. I'm really, I'm really trying to get this other chick. I've been wanting her for like probably about six, seven <laughs> you months. You know what? Now. You might as well bang her and just ruin your life. Yeah, ruin yeah, it, man. Get it over with. You're young. You're young. You're 22. You're young. You might as well just do it. Yeah, because you, you yeah, can't. You can't. The only problem I got is you got the kids, so that you know you got a connection there. But it, it just sounds like you want to move on. You don't want the threesome else. as much as you just want this other chick. <laughs> yeah, the threesome means nothing to him. That's, yeah, that's kind of true. In a way, I'd rather just have the other chick. He would just yeah, leave the. He he'd right. leave his yeah. girl just oh, sitting there out. watching. He, he call him out. He, he wants the other girl. Yeah, you just want the other girl. So you. There's, nothing, there's no way to save you from this. That girl, yeah. did. his girlfriend would just be sitting there watching. <laughs> Little horny twenty-two year old boy. That's it. Yeah, there you uh, go, man. There's nothing to worry about it. Wait till he you just, get thirty. He just reaches over every so often and pats his girl on the shoulder. <laughs> hey, how you doing? That's what Still I made here. a mistake and kissed the girl. <laughs> my girl goes. We was having a good one too. This girl was a trooper. So I'm kissing her, and my girl she looks at me kissing. She goes. What is this flavor of love? <laughs> <laughs> I 
All right, thank you, Ted. Right. <laughs> she couldn't stand it. I was doing all kind of creepy stuff. Yeah. She was just yeah. going with it. And she's a predator, too. What a trooper. Your girlfriend would come uh, back and go, your girlfriend's you know a predator? Got a swing? Oh, she's, she just, she really gets off on, on manipulating women. It's, the, that's, the hunt. Oh, once you get a girl to get into, like, changing a girl's whole, like, Really? So you you how how do you deal with the jealousy? And you, then she goes, well, and I go, oh, and I just sit back and watch her work. <laughs> and she brings them to me on a plan. You're like one of those guys that if you were a serial killer, you'd get your girl to like help you kill people. We, we would we would no question. Me and my girl would go down together. Yeah. It, no question. You'd we be would, one of those that just like uh uh watch the door. Clyde. She got a shotgun. I'm robbing the bank, and we out of there. And then I'm like, the cops is chasing us. I'm like, baby. This is it. <laughs> All right. Lee, what's up? Hey, nothing much. I, I want to say uh, I got a problem with mine when I did it. I kissed her and everything else. I jumped on my girl's trampoline a couple times and went buck wild on the other girl forever. And from then on... <laughs> Wait, so you, all right, hold on. So you're you, being a little selfish. So everyone agreed to the threesome and, uh, you, you were being sort of polite with your, your girlfriend or wife, whatever. But the new girl, you went, uh, you just went animalistic. Yeah, yeah, like I was on Lucky Charms or something. I don't know. I just sugar wild all over, you know, and, uh. You know what the problem is, dude? And this is the problem with men in general, us mm -hmm. right now. Even though he's living his dream, sorta, sorta living his dream. Here's what we do. We do stop the complete honesty process. Here's what you have to do next time you get in that situation is explain to her the nature of why you did that. Now, I had to explain to my girl because we had this argument about it. We watched this prison uh, movie, uh, not a prison movie, a prison documentary on uh, on E. And it was about like Ohio prison. And it was this dude. He was the, the head of the Crips. Now, I am an out-of-shape, middle-aged man. Sometimes I'm ready to go sexually, but it's not like I used to be. Right. This guy was a virile animal, and my girl could not. She literally sat there. We're watching it. She couldn't keep herself from going, mm. <laughs> <laughs> because I felt, I felt that his madness would destroy both of us. <laughs> then she was thinking, oh, my God, look at this hard do what she's thinking in her head what he would do to me so i had to explain to her look sweetie i understand you look at that and you go oh now i don't offer what you know this guy's gonna i know i don't sexually this guy's in prison he's mad he's gonna kill her <laughs> <laughs> you have to explain to her sweetie i love you but i need I, I you do you realize i don't want you around when we're doing threesome i'm i am really doing our relationship a favor by you're doing me a favor by allowing me to get this out of my system but you gotta understand when i want a threesome i want a different girl i want to kiss i know i don't kiss you like i used to because i because I, cause you're the same i, I nothing i do <laughs> men like to manipulate that's our problem you want to manipulate you want to see new panties come wiggling down you want to see a new you want to taste a new taste Trampoline. yes so your woman, you have to explain to her, sweetie, you might, this is what you might have to do, dude. You might have to get her to, you might have to do a threesome with a dude. Can't do it. <laughs> but see, you can't be like that. You can't be like that. Touch me, I gotta kill him. All right, all right, wait, so, so Lee, you ended up kissing the other girl and, and that caused the problem with your wife? Well, that wasn't the only thing. I mean, the girl, the master we was done, you know, she got... Frisky and I got frisky with her. My wife wasn't with it, you know. And, yeah, and, you know, yeah. now 18 years of paying for the little rug rack me and her had, you know, it's just. She wants her to leave right away. You wanted to cuddle. I did too. I, I don't want them to leave. Right. So, I kind of want to hold them and look at them, but you still love your girl. So, so Lee, look at them. So, Lee, you guys still together? You're collecting. Well, well, well we, we are somewhat together, but I'll tell you what, I, I, I just can't. Go there again because I might lose total control and kick the kick the. Yeah, these the threesomes sound like a good idea at the time, but it sounds like it causes a it's bunch a of problems. Rules, out but there. you gotta. But see, the honesty you use to explain, like the 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 pimpness that you need to even get your woman to do that, you need that to. That was her idea. 
There you go. Now you have to. Now you got to throw that in her face. Don't be ashamed to be petty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it was your hey, idea. It was your idea. What the hell? <laughs> your happiness is key, man. <laughs> yeah. It was your idea to order the steak, and you know I love steak. What the hell? You didn't know what this was gonna do to me. Yeah, and and so I, I overate. Jeez, I mean, <laughs> you know how much I love the steak. Yeah. How much? Supposed yeah. to do. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you one thing, though. It, it is one of the greatest things when it's happening. But the guilt that you get when the girl look, your girl looks at you and says, uh, "Was she better than me?" Yeah. Yeah. But I love you. Just always throw love. But you know, love and lust, they both start with L. You know. And... No, I love. All right, you, baby. all right, Lee. I'll punch it out. Thanks for sharing.